Based on information received from the prison director Gladwin Samuels, the incident occurred at about 2.15 hours. The evening news understands that the individual, who is presently unknown to investigators, was seen acting in a suspicious manner at the northeastern section of the penitentiary's holding area by prison ranks. It was also observed that the suspect was in the process of throwing a black plastic wrapped parcel over the fence. As such, the ranks discharged rounds at the individual, who in turn fled the scene and made good his escape. However, as he was fleeing, the man reportedly dropped the parcel. As such, a search conducted in the area revealed a total of 10 parcels, a camouflage hat and a pair of short camouflage pants. Samuels has confirmed that the parcels contained 1,002 grams of marijuana, a large quantity of tobacco leaves, four cell phones without SIM cards, one charger, one earpiece, and 33 packs of Bristol cigarettes. Investigations are ongoing. Just last week, Public Security Minister Kemraj Ramjatan had expressed absolute anger at the upsurging cases regarding the smuggling and attempted smuggling of contraband into prisons countrywide. He had also indicated that he has been having discussions with the Finance Minister Winston Jordan so as to have funds allocated in the next budget presentation to purchase scanners. He intends to have these implemented at the entrances of each prison. In addition to civilians being implicated in the smuggling of contraband into the prisons, a number of ranks attached to the joint services have been caught red-handed and charged. Ramona Luti for The Evening News.